everyone. Today we're going to be taking a little trip around the world. We're going to be looking at landmarks. But what is a landmark? A landmark is something that makes a country special, either a building or a statue that it's famous for. So you'll know a country by some of its landmarks. For example, you might know London by Big Ben or Italy by the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Let's travel around the world and have a look at some of them. We're going to head up to Rio de Janeiro to see Christ the Redeemer. We're going to carry on right up to Europe. In Europe, there are many, many landmarks. London has Big Ben, Tower Bridge, and many others. Paris in France has the Eiffel Tower, which is known the world over. Carrying on to Italy, Italy has the Leaning Tower of Pisa, as well as the Colosseum and many others. We're going to head down south now to Australia, where we can have a look at the very famous Sydney Opera House and Harbour Bridge. Right guys, ready to head back home and get going with our own art project. Have a little look at an atlas that you've got at home and find a country that you're interested in. I've chosen France for my project and I'm going to be looking at the Eiffel Tower. I love the Eiffel Tower and actually I've been to the top of it. Once you've found a picture of your famous landmark, start by drawing it. This part of the project is quite important because the shape of a landmark is often what makes it famous and recognisable throughout the world. Once I've finished drawing my landmark, I'm going to paint the background using watercolour paints. But you can obviously choose anything you like to use. In a minute, I'll be showing you some materials that you could use. I love the Eiffel Tower, so that's why I've chosen to do the Eiffel Tower as my landmark. But remember, you can choose any landmark in the whole world to do your project on. It could be in any country. It could be a statue, or a building, or a bridge. It's entirely up to you. Have a look with mum or dad, or an older sibling, at some landmarks around the world, and ask them to help you choose an interesting one. Now you can do your landmark anywhere you like. You could do it as a collage, like I'm doing mine. You may choose to paint yours, or draw yours, or build yours. The sky really is the limit with this project and there's lots of materials you can use. Straws, toothpicks, bottle tops, bread tags, different shapes of pasta, magazines and newspapers, and even empty toilet rolls. Have a look around your house and see what you can find. You can be really creative for this project and you can make your landmark in all sorts of different ways using different materials and different techniques. Here are some examples for you to have a look at to get your imagination going. I hope you've enjoyed our trip around the world looking at landmarks. Now it's time to make your own landmark. Have fun and be creative. Remember to like, share and comment if you've enjoyed this project. See you again soon.